And here she is, folks. The new EVH Wolfgang Special. Um, this thing <laughs> just sounds huge. The the pickup. Well, here we'll start here. It has uh, the EVH Floyd Rose with a cool little touch here. It's got the drop D tuner called the D tuna actually on this thing, but I just called it drop D tuner, which is kind of freaking cool on a Floyd Rose, kind of a cool invention. Um, it has, which I think is kind of a neat touch here too, a high friction tone knob. So you gotta, you gotta mean to turn this thing to turn it. I wish it didn't even have a tone knob, to be honest. I was going to get a Kramer Beretta with only a volume, only a volume knob on it, but this has a high friction tone knob. So it, it doesn't turn easily at all when you set it, set it and forget it, right? And it has a real low friction. You can see I'm barely even trying to move that volume knob for, you know, doing swells and just uh, in the middle of a tune, you need to turn down your output a little bit. That's real easy to turn. Um, it has two EVH overwound, and this is kind of cool, direct mount. I don't know if you can see from here, they're directly mounted into the, is it missing a screw? No, it's not. I'm sorry. My bad. Okay. I was looking through my camera here, but they're overwound EVH humbuckers, which are just enormous sounding. It's a basswood body, um, toggle switch, you know, bridge, middle, and a neck pickup. The, uh, it's not really a truss rod. It's more of a wheel, uh, to, to adjust, which is here at the, uh, top of the neck. And it is a 100% maple neck. And of course, you know, the retainer and the locking bridge. And this thing is just pretty. It's just pretty. The, my only complaint at all, these things retail for about a thousand bucks, which is about what I paid for it. Um, the frets are pretty smooth. They're not sticking out the edge like some of these guitars you see these days, but uh, I think they could have done a little, little tiny better job of just kind of smoothing out the frets on the edges here. My Stratocaster, my Rando Blaster, the, the neck feels like absolute silk. It's so smooth. And this one, is it, it's not not smooth, but it's, you know, again, I just wish they would have took a little bit of extra time to kind of smooth out the frets a little bit but like i said it's not bad it's not bad at all that would be my only complaint so let's uh let's fire this thing up and hear it what do you think <laughs> distorted they're clear they're clear and loud <laughs> just a little tip too i had someone uh at one of our last gigs uh ask me he goes man you got a great tone why is your tone so clear and my recommendation to everybody out there is turn the gain down you don't need your gain my processor actually the gain goes from zero to 99 and i keep the gain on 20 so I, I'm way down there on the gain. I don't crank the gain and, uh, you know, rely on effects to get my sound. Actually, the best sound you can get is out of good guitar. <laughs> so, you know, get rid of your cheap guitar and get a good one. And... <laughs> Fuck. 
playing this thing at our next gig the new EVH Wolfgang special MIM -M.